it's Ruby Rags World of Dolls and welcome back. Guys, thanks so much for dropping by. I have here this beautiful doll from the Glitter Girls line and this is called Kelty. And she's just adorable. She will be my third Glitter Girl. Guys, I was not intending to purchase these Glitter Girl dolls. I thought they were adorable. I saw them in my local Target every time I went in there. And I was always tempted to grab a couple. But I will always resist because I'm running out of space. You know, it's either start downsizing and start purging dolls or just stop buying so many. So I kind of tried to pull back a little bit and have some restraint and not buy every doll that I like and love because I can't do it. So I did not buy these dolls, but I did purchase some fashion packs. Um, the Glitter Girl Fashion Packs, because the Glitter Girl Fashion Packs are fabulous, well-made. You know, it's like the same brand that does our generation. A lot of bang for your buck. But I bought the Fashion Packs because they fit my Welly Wisher. The Welly Wishers and the Glitter Girls have the exact same size bodies. It's like their bodies are molded exactly the same. So I bought the Fashion Packs for my Welly Wisher. Well, once I decided I liked the Fashion Packs and decided I would go back and get the dolls because they did have them on clearance. They were all gone. So, you know, I lost out. But then, you, whoever believes in second chances, I do. I was in my local Ollie's and I was able to get these two girls here for $9.99. So, it was like, hey, I got an opportunity to get them again. And these were the only two that they had available. So, of course, I grabbed them. The hair is so soft, and they're just so nice and well-made. Everything about these dolls is awesome. So, my dolly sister, Miss Computer Wizard, she goes out of town on occasion, and when she does, she's always going on a dolly hunt, and she always thinks about me. So, you know, she was in a, TG, no, a Tuesday morning, and she sent me photos because she knew that I did not have her and asked me was I interested. And of course I was. They only had two on the shelf. So I told her to please pick her up for me. And she did. And she was $14.99. And she is from the bendable. Uh, her joints, her arms and legs are bendable. So her vinyl is that type of vinyl that you can bend. And I'm not sure why these two girls aren't because they are from the same wave, I thought. But, you know, I don't know a lot about these dolls. But she's very beautiful. I just love that sweet little face. They all have these adorable little faces. But her name, again, is Kelty. And she's quite adorable. I like these little girls. This is what the side of her box looks like. Nothing fancy, but really adorable. And then here on the side, you've got this. And then, you know, this packaging is made from 100% recyclable materials. And it's printed with soy-based ink. So what a great way to help save the planet. And then here on the back, we got a picture of this adorable girl. And I mean, she's just adorable. And I love her outfit. And then here we have a great shot of all of these girls in this wave. They are so adorable. And here are the two that I already have. And they're all adorable. Every one of them. I would love to have them all. I mean, they're 14 inches tall. They don't take up a lot of space, but still can't get every doll that you like you just can't <laughs> but they're very beautiful dolls so i'm going to get kelty out of the box so that she's able to join the girls and we will be right back she is so adorable and i do like the soft body she is very weighted a lot more heavier well not a lot but there is a difference in their um, weight a little when you pick them up. So she has the bendable joints. But let's look at that beautiful, adorable, sweet face. She is so adorable. She has this beautiful, dark browns, long, soft, I say straight, curly hair. It has a little curl to it at the end. 
she's adorable and it's pulled up in a high ponytail and then of course she's got that adorable little glitter girls um hair bow um on there and it's just one of those clip on slide out ones and then she has these beautiful rooted eyelashes as all the girls do she has feathered eyebrows and i just love those big beautiful brown eyes she's just adorable she has a little um rosiness in her cheeks she's just so sweet i just love it i think she's adorable and then let's look at her little outfit i just love it she has a little pink tee with this little design on the front and it's just cute and then the sleeve she has cuff sleeves and it velcros here in the back then she has on this adorable little skirt and I love this skirt I like the glitter that it has here at the hem and there's specks of glitter all over the skirt really and the design goes all the way around in the back so what you get in the front you get in the back the skirt velcros in the back and she has two looks guys because you can remove the skirt and I have to get my scissors because the skirt is stitched to her top so let me take the stitches cut that these scissors are so dull once you start opening paper with scissors you know what happens to the blade it becomes dull all right come on thread all right let me get her because i'm not trying to cut her little top here or her skirt all right so the skirt just comes off and then she has two separate looks and I like it a lot. We'll get that later. But underneath, she has these adorable leggings. And I like all of those little tri upside down triangles, up with triangles. You've got the gold ones, pink ones, and green ones. And I think these little leggings are so adorable. And I have a bunch of the leggings, too. I got every pair that they had in big lots and I got some when they had them in Target. They were 99 cents and they also came with shoes. So you got a pair of leggings and a pair of shoes. And then she's wearing these adorable little um, shoes with the glitter on them. And they fasten here on the side. And she's just so adorable. I just love it. I love how her little outfit has two different ways to wear it. I like the little skirt. Let me show you guys what I mean about this little skirt. And I don't know if the um, camera is going to pick up the little glitter in it. But it's just so adorable. And this is what I mean about the quality. These little items are so detailed and very well made. And I like things like that. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Everything is all finished. You know, very well made. And I like that a lot. So let's get her back in her skirt because I like both looks, but I'm going to put her back in her little skirt. And then I want to show you guys her bendable joints. How she can bend her arms and her, um, and her legs. I did bend one of her arms inside the box. And I wanted to see would it stay in that position until I took till I took it out of that position. And of course it did. So let's see. Her head turns from side to side with ease, meaning her head will go all the way around. Her arms do go up and they go back. They do not go out. She does have um, articulation at the hip, so you can sit her down. And then this is what happens when you bend her arm at the elbow. You see how she can bend. And it seems like I can feel something inside, like a wire or something, that bends. So, you can bend them both. My hands, you guys know I've told you about my hands. Strength in my hands is not like it used to be. So, these are the bendable, um, bendable arms, bend at the elbow. I don't know if her wrists, you can bend her wrists. No, that won't bend. That won't stay. But then let's see about her knee. Yeah. 
so you can bend her at the knee so her knee will bend so that's pretty cool I like that that means you're able to sit her in a chair and bend her knees and again they stay in that position until you take her out now since I bent her joints she acts like she doesn't want to balance on her own <laughs> But you did see the whole time that she could, she does stand on her own. But this is what her joints look like when you can bend them. I think it's really, really cool. And then she also comes with what they all come with. You get a little hair care guide. These are the same things you get with the Our Generation dolls. Just tells you how to take care of the doll's hair so that you can get longevity out of it. If you follow the instructions, you know, your doll will last a very, very long time. She is so adorable. I am so glad to be adding her to my collection of glitter girls. These girls are so adorable. Again, I like them all so much. But this, she must be from the neural wave that has the bendable joints but i thought the outfit that she was wearing and the face molds because it seems like their face faces changed a little bit i don't know but i don't again i don't know all the background about these dolls i just know they're darling but these girls do not have the bendable joints their bodies are hard their bodies are made like the welly wishers no bending those guys Thank you so much for dropping by. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram on Ruby Red's World of Dolls there as well. Guys, please don't forget to tell me what is your opinion of the Glitter Girls. Do you own any of these little dollies? Do you like them? I would love to hear what you think. I love reading y'all's comments. You guys are so awesome and fantastic. And I just look forward to hearing what you have to say. Guys, continue being awesome, fantastic, and fabulous, and I will see you in my next review.